Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today, yes, we do have our unboxing for Bonjour Jolie for the month of October. This poor box, uh, this box has been through uh, a lot. Maybe not this one specifically, but I will say, I know a lot of you have been commenting um, on my uh, page about Bonjour Jolie that you subscribe and you had not been receiving your box for this month. Mine also had that same issue. Um, I was supposed to receive this a couple weeks ago and did not. I sent a couple emails. I finally sent another email to the CEO and got a response with a support ticket, basically explaining, you know, again, kind of what we talked about in previous videos that the mail has been all over the place and slow. And I totally understand that. I know, I hope this kind of, you know, rectifies itself pretty soon, but um, they did have to send me a new box. I don't know what happened to my original one. I don't know if it's just lost somewhere, uh, but they sent me a new one. I ended up getting, um, uh, a new tracking number and it was shipped out pretty quickly and I got it in just a couple days. So I did receive it. We're going to open it and see what we have, but I did want to address that and I'd just be real with you. I'm not, you know, going to lie and, and, you know, say, oh, everything's fine. It was tough. Uh, it was tough this month. So hopefully things are getting back under control for the next few months here because I do love this box. I love receiving this box. Um, but it was a struggle this month. So hopefully if you had some of the same issues, uh, you were able to contact someone at Bonjour Jolie and get your replacement box. And if you have not, I highly recommend uh, emailing the CEO and hopefully getting that support ticket for yourselves as well. But we're gonna see what we have for this month. It is actually the end of the month. I'm filming this on the 31st. So this is uh, our Halloween day. So I'm assuming, I could be wrong, if this has a Halloween theme, Peek here, yep. Halloween theme. Uh, it is perfect for today. So uh, we'll look at the bright side of the situation. Yes, it's late, um, but the fact that it's Halloween today, we're gonna see what we have. So um, if you're not familiar with Bonjour Jolie, this is a monthly period subscription box. And so you're gonna get all your period supplies. You can pick pads, tampons, whatever uh, style you want, whatever brand you want. You can actually mix and match. Um, and you can also get pain reliever and, um, uh, you know, cleaning items. And then of course you also get a, uh, gift, a pampering item, and also edible items, which again, my son and my husband always wait to see what I get. Like, Ooh, what did you get this month? Um, so yeah, this is a, I, I, I love this one for a variety of reasons. Um, and it is a really fun box to open. So we're going to see what we have for this month for October. Look how cute our little ghost here and our really nice card this month. Um, oh, it's very basic though. I uh, gave us some basic stuff. Uh, really cute. It says trick or treat. So our theme is trick or treat uh, for October 2021. Yeah, our, our info is kind of short to this week or this month, but we'll see. Um, and super cute wrapping here uh, with your tissue paper. Do you guys keep your tissue paper? Like when you get it like this, do you guys try to keep it? I try. Um, sometimes it ends up in the garbage, but I want to try. So, oh, cute. It says spooktacular things inside. I think it's a sticker. Cute. All right. So let's see what we have. Okay. Oh, all right. So yeah, seen those before. Okay. So we're going to start with just the period supplies. We're going to get them out of the way. They wrap them up in, um, another bag. And of course this month is pure black. Uh, it usually has a theme to it obviously Halloween trick or treat here. So you get all your period supplies. Again, you get pads, tampons, uh, panty liners, whatever you want there. And they package them up nicely so you can go put them in, away. And then you also get your pain reliever and your um, cleaning supplies as well. So you can request Advil, uh, Tylenol, Midol. I think those are the pretty much the items there, but I know you can kind of um, pick the different ones you want. I am a fan of Advil, so I go for those. All right, so rest of this is all the fun stuff as well. All right, so we're gonna keep the edible items for a second. Oh, that's so stinking cute. Okay, I don't wanna jump to it. All right, so our first thing, okay, I'm assuming this is it, okay. All right, so our first thing must be the gift. Yes, this is Be A Bombshell Cosmetics, the one stick in Hocus Pocus, and this retails for $16. Okay, so this is called Be A Bombshell. I feel like we got some new ones before. Uh, the one stick in Hocus Pocus. You see that? All right, let's see what this is. So this says, it's an all-in-one multiple stick with a smooth texture that adds a perfect pop of color to your cheeks, face, and eyes. Whoa. Let's see what color that is. Whoa, that is so Hocus Pocus. Look at that. 
That's a purple. It's cute though. What do you think? I don't know. Uh, it definitely reminds me of Hocus Pocus. Like thinking of like, you know, the movie Hocus Pocus, uh, kind of magic, witches, things like that. I love that. That's a kind of cool color. And I love that it's like versatile. I'm not gonna use it. I don't know. I'm gonna I'm gonna hold on to that for a second, but that's pretty cool. So it's Be a Bombshell Cosmetics, this the one stick in Hocus Pocus. I'm just not gonna try it out right now, that's what I mean. All right, cool. So that's our gift. Then we get a pampering item, which wait till you see this. That's what I thought it was something food at first. I'm like, no, no. It's a little cauldron. Look, okay. This is from uh, oh, I'm so sorry. By the way, this was from BeABombshellCosmetics.com. So make sure you said that. All right. This is from The Bomb Gals. And I know we've had something from them before, like these different bath bombs. This is the Witch's Cauldron Bubbling Bath Bomb. So fun. And this retails for $10. It says, enjoy a bubbling and fizzing bath bomb cauldron in your bath. So fun. Fun. The reason I thought it was food is I think these are little candies at the top. I don't, those look like those little sour candies, but there's a bat and a boo and a bone. What is this other one here? Oh, it's like a little uh, gravestone. Oh my gosh, so cute. And look at that purple again. So I don't, I guess when you open it, you do you throw the whole thing in there? Cause this is not the bath bomb. It's like a little container. Let me see if it says anything. No, it just says Epsom salt, Himalayan sea salt, baking soda, citric acid, organic jojoba oil, organic shea butter, organic cocoa butter, argan oil, organic essential oils. Fun. Okay, so I'm, I don't know, that's really cute. Um, I guess you just throw the whole thing in your bath and then maybe the cauldron like starts bubbling up. That'd be kind of fun. So cute. Would that be fun to do after trick or treating? Like run a bath and like go put that in there. Cute. All right, so that was our gift. That was our pampering item. Now we get the edibles. All right, so our first thing here, and it doesn't tell me anything about the product, so I'm just gonna go with what I think it is. Uh, I've seen this one before, of course. These are the uh, garden veggie chips in ghosts and bats in sea salt. Um, these are great for gluten-free people. So if you can't have like the pretzels and all kinds of stuff, this is uh, gluten-free um, and yeah, non-GMO, okay. So we have a little garden veggie, ghosts and bats, great for a snack. And then look at this bag of goodness. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, my son's gonna flip out once you see what's in here. Yeah, like I told you, my, my husband and my son are always like, oh, you got Bonjour Jolie, what'd you get? <laughs> um, if there's some months I may, maybe get one treat out of here. All right, so if I can get this off, hold on, this is really twisted up. Is this my trick to get this thing open? And then I get treats, there we go, I got it. I got it. All right, so opening the bag. All right, let's just start taking some stuff out here. All right, first thing we have is our M&Ms, and this is actually my favorite flavor of M&M. Uh, or is it a flavor? I guess I'm gonna say it's a type, I don't know. Anyway, type of, type of M&M is the um, peanut M&Ms, and we get a whole bag here. Probably my favorite one. Okay, don't judge me. I actually will put one in my mouth and I'll just hold it there and I'll like suck on it until the candy goes away and the chocolate goes away and then I'm left with the peanut. Does anybody else do that? I don't know, just me. Um, anyway, so we have a bag of M&Ms, peanut M&Ms, love that. All right, next we have, oh, my husband's gonna love this one. We have a Reese's, oh, peanut butter pumpkin. So very good. We have a Kit Kat Witch's Brew. <gasps> yes! Oh my gosh! Okay, I'll just tell you the story. This is Witch's Brew. It says crisp wafers in marshmallow flavored cream. Okay, I have been searching for these and I could not find them. No way! Okay, I'm so excited right now. So yeah, this is the Witch's Brew and it's supposed to be crisp wafers in marshmallow flavored cream. And I could not find these anywhere. So I'm so excited. All right, this one's gonna be mine. I get to try it. I'm a marshmallow fan, I'm a chocolate fan. Um, yeah, okay, those are mine. Yay! Oh my gosh, oh I got two! Yay! Okay, that's what I'm gonna have for my treat. That'll be it, that's my Halloween treat. All right, next we, <laughs> it's the little things in life. Uh, Flips, minis, chocolate covered, or milk chocolate covered pretzels. All right, so Drew can 
enjoy those as well or the hubby all right we have some more Reese's peanut butter pumpkins okay more pumpkins and then we have hair bow which you can debate me on this one all you want but this is the best gummy in the world is Haribo um, Twin Snakes. These are the sweet and sour ones. I know I've had these before. So these are the Haribo ones. And again, best gummy out there. You can debate me, but it's true. All right, this is what I think Drew's gonna go nuts for. Look at this. Okay, so you always get some type of drink item in your box. So usually it's tea or like during the holidays, it might be like hot chocolate, uh, summer months or lemonade. This month, y'all, we have Skittles drink mix yep okay we have green apple and strawberry yeah i think drew's gonna want to try these i mean it's full sugar but uh yeah well it says low calorie but i'm sure it's not low sugar i don't see an ingredient list on here unfortunately or i don't see a um nutrition facts but it does say just to put this in a large glass of water shake the bottle or mix yep Yep, that's basically what it is. So it's just like a drink mix and I'm sure he'll love to try that. All right, and then there's something else. Oh, cute. Okay, I didn't realize what this was. So there's a little cute little bag here and we have some Hershey Kisses it looks like, but they are, oh, these are regular, wait. This one's regular? Oh no, this is, oh, it just says eek. So cute, we have little eyes on that one. Let me see, there's something else in here, hang on. Yeah, but I won again. What are these? Okay, yeah, this is the vampire, uh, vampire something. This is vampire, this is vampire. Um, and I think it has like an oozy, like red something on the center. And I don't know if it's cherry or strawberry or fruit something. And I'm not a big like fruit filled, kind of like chocolate person. So I'm not gonna try that. I'll give that to again, uh, Drew or Joe. But um, those are in the little bag there. So cute. All right, so we do those when we Halloween themed where I had a feeling it was gonna be Halloween themed and it did not disappoint. It's a lot of fun. Um, and it's just a fun way to you know deal with something that's not so fun for that month, right? I mean, who, who enjoys that? I don't know. Um, so yeah, that's everything in this box. So you have all your supplies, you have all your goodies. And yes, um, hopefully things will get back on track for November. Let's cross our fingers. We'll be very thankful for that. Um, but otherwise, what do you guys think? I will put a link below. You can check out Bone George Relief for yourself. And, uh, you know, again, stay, stay with it, stay patient. And I'll see you guys again soon. Bye.